Previously on Fallout New Vegas. Courier 6 made a new friend in Prim and took to calling him Eddie. The happy couple took off to find a sheriff at none other than the recently overran correctional facility. As you might guess, meeting with the Powder Gangers ended rather explosively. But even so, the Courier was able to strike a deal and get Prim a new sheriff. However, that sheriff had a criminal record, and the Courier would need to find him an official pardon from the NCR. Hey gang, what's good? Welcome back to Fallout New Vegas. We're here at NCRCF. NCRCF. We're looking at a shirtless man with some dynamite strapped across his chest. What a maniac. All right, we are going to actually, um, hmm. We can't fast travel directly out of here while we're wearing their uh, outfit, can we? Because then uh, regular folks will think, Oh no, that's that's a bad dude, and they're going to shoot at us. And that's not something that we want, now is it? So we're going to have to sneak on over this direction. Let's quick save here. Uh-oh. We are actually detected right here. Who? Oh, is it him? Is it him up there? Hmm. That's never something you want. Maybe it's these guys up here. Oh no, it's this guy. It's definitely this guy right there, who's just like stood right there. Alright. Right here we can actually sneak. Okay. We'll pop off our outfit. Um, put on our old duster. And then, we will immediately fast travel out back to Prim. Uh-oh. Okay. Well, we are going to put on our Powder Ganger outfit. And then we are going to fast travel out to Good Spring Source. There we go. And then we can fast travel to um, to Prim. We might actually, hmm. No, let's, um, yeah, let's, let's put on our regular thing. I was going to say maybe we should go and sell stuff. But nah. We'll just store it on uh, Eddie, right? I think that's a good idea. Okay. Let's see here. Let's have our old revolver out. And let's see, Eddie... Here. Take our disguise. Uh, you can take this stupid old cowboy hat as well. Hmm, should we? Hmm. We probably don't need to be holding on to all this shit. Store four of them, keep five. Store these. Powder charges. Oh, these are the things that we can make now, isn't, aren't they? Okay. Pretty heavy. We'll just stash them. Why not? Hmm. The rest of this, I guess, we'll, we'll just sell when we get to get to town. For now. All right. Let's see. Nobody out here? Sure. Now let's go all the way down to Primland. We're in our sheriff's outfit, so no one will. We'll think that we're up to no good in the neighborhood. All right. Let's see. Oh, there he is. It's the man of the hour. Let's quick save. Let's see what he... Oh, where are you going? Hey. What are you doing, man? I just want to talk. What's he doing? Oh, okay. He just... Oh. What? Hey. Have you gotten my pardon from the NCR yet? Oh, right. Um, where, where should I go to get you a pardon? There's an NCR camp down there on the southern border of Nevada. Camp Mojave, I think. Try to find someone of authority there. Okay. Who's in charge of the Powder Gangers? Right now, Eddie and his boys run the place. They've got the guns and the dynamite, so they call the shots. Eddie, huh? Uh, tell me more about what happened in the prison. I understand that Cook was behind it all. I kept my head down the whole time. Didn't want any part of it. I stuck around, figuring the NCR would show up and put things back the way they were. No sense in making myself look guilty, right? Who's Cook? Some kind of anti-NCR rebel. Some people just don't like being pushed around and told what to do. Where can I find Cook? He went north with some of the other guys. Didn't say where. Didn't say why. All I know is he's got some kind of score to settle with the NCR. Hmm. Okay. Watch yourself out there. Well, 
Let's, uh, let's track his quest here, and let's see. Yeah, alright, yeah. The Mojave Outpost. Okay, sure. Let's check in with, um, Nash. Maybe we can sell some stuff. Do you think he's, uh, he's at the Mojave Express by now? Or, do, or hmm, maybe he still hangs out inside the, uh, the casino. Oh, yeah, we, we need to get the, the gun. Oh, I almost forgot. Oh, yeah, we gotta get, get ourselves a gun. That's, uh, <laughs> I don't remember the rest of the words. It's the, uh, the opening to the Sopranos. Hmm. I think those are good for, like, um, crafting with, uh, survival. We may need to look into doing that. That seems fun. Might be something I can do, like, um, off camera, like, between videos and be like, All right, guys, uh, we all came back and, uh, I got a big load of crazy cool stuff. I cooked up. Oh, hey it's there. Deputy Beagle. What? Was that his... That's not how Deputy Beagle sounds. All right. <laughs> Where is Nash? Oh, here he is. Right? Yeah. You got that old robot up and running again? How's it working out for you? Oh, yeah, Eddie. Man, Eddie is a fucking maniac, dude. Your robot is bonkers, dude. Um... I have some questions about uh, Eddie. Yeah, why is Eddie mad as hell? That beat up old pile of bolts. What do you want to know? Uh, where did it come from? The courier dropped it off a little bit ago. I'd hoped to get it up and running for some courier work, but never could get it running. Any idea what I should do with it? Not a bit. I imagine there must be some people around curious about that kind of technology. Hmm. Don't go getting yourself shot. Jesus, I don't like I don't like how he said that so low. Like he was implying something. Oh right, we need to actually trade with you, Johnson Nash. Hey, youngster. Let's see. Caravan, no, 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 no. There we go. Oh yeah, look, he's got back his uh his good stuff. Does he have Magnum shit? No, he does not. Dang it, Johnson Nash, the only thing we needed. Look, he's got a uh, boxing eh, that's no good. Fixing the that's nah. <laughs> hmm. All right. Let's sell some some garbage. Let's see. Get rid of baseball bat, bladed gauntlet. No thanks. Laser pistol. We have a plasma, which uses uh, the same ammo type, I believe. Single shotgun. No. Okay. What about this? Hmm. Huh. Oh, we've got plenty of uh, cigarettes, don't we? Or at least a few. Lunchbox. I think we can use the lunchbox for something. Maybe we hold on to that. Hmm. All right. Accept. Thanks. Let's actually um, sell him some of our explosives that we've got on Eddie, huh? Hmm. Mines we don't really need, do we? Let's take all of these, this dynamite. We're just gonna walk around with shitloads of bombs. Where do your mobs? I came to drop bombs. Frag grenades do more damage, okay. Well, we, we might want to hold on to that shit, shouldn't we? Alright. Johnson Nash. Hey, youngster. Um, let's see. There we go. And... Let's see, hmm, we'll sell like 24, huh? There we go. Sure. We'll keep the rest. Thanks. Thank you, Old Man Nash. Yeah, bye. Is that rude to call him Old Man Nash, or is that endearing? I think that's endearing, right? Howdy. Grandma Nash. That's endearing, right? Th those are all endearing things to call folks. All right. Let's peek in here and finally get our prize. It's time to take the prize. Let's see, which one is it in? Howdy. Oh, what the fuck? Is there a guy in here? Uh, Eddie, was that you talking to me? <laughs> Howdy, it's me, Eddie. I'm a fucking lunatic. I like to shoot people and throw shopping carts. Damn, Eddie. All right, let's see here. Um, let's see. What, um... We've got this. I think that increases our... 
our abilities a little bit. Let's see. 62. Okay. We need to get our perception up a little bit, huh? Hmm. Do we actually have something to increase our perception? Yeah, Mentats, right? Yeah, the go-to. There we go. Alright, and let's down this. And we should be good to open it. Yeah! Man, good thing the timer doesn't tick while we're doing this, huh? There we go. Um, oh shit, where is it? Oh shit, is it not here? Uh-oh. Oh well, we gotta level up, I'll take it. Um, uh, hmm, let's, let's consult our thing here. Let's see, take up guns to 45. And we want to get melee weapons up to 45 to unlock a perk. Here we go. Um, let's see. Let's cross those off. And let's see. Where's comprehension at? There it is. Yeah, comprehension is great. Okay, well, where's, um... Where's this gun at that I'm looking for? Oh. No. Is this... No? Hmm. Well, what the heck? Maybe I just imagined it. What the hell? Yeah, weird. Huh. Oh, well. I could have sworn there was, um, the revolver up in here. Must have been mistaken. All right. Sure. Maybe it's in one of these registers? There's pre-war money. Should definitely be taking that. Hmm. Weird. Maybe it's somewhere else in this casino. Man, am I, like, tripping major balls right now? So that safe's empty. Fixing things. Hmm. Salesman Weekly. Garbage can. It's got some sarsaparilla in it. Man, who threw away a perfectly fine bottle? Jeez. What a bunch of guys. All right. Anything in this? Nope. Hmm. Where's this, uh, yeah, hey over there. here. No. Huh. Weird. Howdy. Oh, man. Maybe it was in the other building. Oh, Howdy. shit. Oh, no. Did our thing wear off as well? Yeah, it wore off. Hmm. Yeah, remember there's the, um, the thing inside the Bison Steve. We don't have another locksmith, do we? Let's check here. Items. No, we don't. Oh, no, we fucked ourselves! It might be inside the Bison Steve, because remember there was a little thing we couldn't get into. Because it required 75. May have been it. Okay, we'll be back for you. Ooh, we actually can check this, um, this nearby... Uh, the, the actual housing area of Prim. There might be some sort of uh, locksmith thing in here. I don't know. We'll have a look. We'll see. Shit. I should have put some points into uh, locksmithing then instead of uh, melee. Oh, uh, well. We'll get there eventually. <laughs> By the time we do, we may not need the gun anymore. All right. Let's sneak inside. Let's see. We're quick saving just in case uh, everyone's awake and they get mad as hell because they're like, Who's this fucking guy? Oh. Jeez. Oh, jeez. <laughs> what a grisly sight. Anything else here? No? Not picking up anyone on the radar. What is that? Oh, look at my cowboy hat clipping up there. What does that say? Gam... Gramophone. No? Gam... Gamphones? 20... 20 gam? 20 giga... Giga games? What? I have no fucking clue. 
U.S. declares state of war. One battleship lost, 1,500 killed in Hawaii. Bum, 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 All right. Doesn't seem to be anything worthwhile in this house. Okay, let's see. Oh, we need to be sure to check these mailboxes. Sometimes there are definitely goodies in them. Not considered stealing either to be stealing folks' mail, but... Eh, I guess who, who am I to judge? Okay. Let's check out this. No, it's empty. This house, though. Oh, Programmer's Digest. Ooh, that's good. Alright. What's inside this one? We'll quick save again. Hmm. Ugh. Iguana bits. Okay. Anything else? Noodle bowl? Some dirty water? Some scotch. Oh, fridge is empty. Jeez, I'm too quick on the on the trigger. I keep looting things that are already telling me that they're empty. Let's see, anything in here? Oh, a nice little bear. Oh, that's cute. Cabinet. Wow, okay. Sure, take all that. Uh, whiskey. Yep, I'll take all the whiskey. Hmm, nothing else, really. Alright. Jeez, all these buildings are vacant. Is that something? No, that's that's just part of the messed up radio. Okay. Let's see. We check this, right? Yeah, shot glass. Okay. Anything in this? Coffee mug. Oh, I was looking at um some of the recipes. We can make coffee. Which is uh, definitely something that I want to do. Holy crap. With all the coffee I drink in real life, I should definitely at least consider making coffee in this video game. Like, why not? Oh, meeting people. That's a good one to have. Oh, I didn't loot it. There we go. Alright. Quick save again. Still no locksmith one. Which is what we really want. Let's see. Nobody's home, I don't think. Pressure cooker. Anything in here? Atomic cocktail. More whiskey. More whiskey. Okay. Oh, shit! A blue star cap! Right on, man! Alright, anything else? Uh, detergent. A bed. Nice bed. First aid. Bitter drink. Mmm, delicious bitter drink. Merc grunt outfit. Eh. Can't steal pillows. <laughs> uh, sarsaparilla is opened. Look, we can't even hear the radio. Yep, nailed it. Okay. Don't want to get caught. You know what I'm saying. Alright, let's see. Is there anything inside those? No. Okay. I think that it's just one more house down here, right? We checked this, didn't we? Yeah. Man, I'm gonna be bummed if we don't find a, uh, a locksmith thing. Maybe they'll have one at the Mojave Outpost. Or somewhere along the way. Yeah. Pack of cigarettes. Anything else? Cabinets. Full of good shit. Ugh, man. Must have been that time of the month. Uh, let's see here. Nah. Hidden suitcase. Ooh, full of sarsaparilla. The secret of the sass. Oh. Detergent. All is detergent, but nobody's actually cleaning their porcelain, uh, appliances. Is that what you would call it? A porcelain appliance? I don't know. Frigidaire. Isn't that like a real brand? Must be from the mod. Oh, this must be where Ruby lives. Good thing she's not here right now to see me stealing more of her casserole. Alright. Well, too bad. So sad. We didn't find any more locksmith uh, digests. Alright, let's see. We need to head on out there to... Uh... Yeah, out that away. Canyon wreckage, wreckage, I'm pretty sure, is... Uh... 
It's for one of the DLC that we looked earlier at. Okay. We got our pistol arrow at the ready. Anything secret back there? No. Alright. Now there should be some geckos out this way, right? We saw some geckos around this, these parts. No? No geckos here. Alright. We gotta get to the road a bit, huh? Turn off our light. We don't need that on. In the middle of broad daylight. Let's see. Now if I remember, there's some banditos over by that, uh... That diner? I think that's a diner. Hmm. Are there buildings over on this side, too? Like, outside of the limits of the town? I can't recall. I do not know. Whew, that was close. I'm forgetting that there's, uh... Fall damage is, a uh, Is a danger. It's still a threat. Let's poke on over here. There's some... Some, like, fencing or something. Hmm. Oh, is this the drive-in? Oh, yeah. We need to avoid that, huh? Yeah, we'll, we'll walk around that. Like, there's, um... Something over there. Hmm. We'll walk around the drive-in. Oh, look. Check it out. It's a ghoul. Alright. Should we pull out our rifle first? Yeah, let's pull out our rifle. That way we can get a long-range hit in. Well, shit. Look at them go! <laughs> Where are they going? Uh-oh. Here they come. Gotcha. Oh, man. Missed that one. Let's reload here. Oh, look at Eddie. Nailing him. Good job, Eddie. Radex. Okay. Let's see. Let's poke around up here. Hmm. Maybe this isn't the DLC one. Oh yeah, it's down here. Yeah, this is a different one. This is a different drive-in altogether. California Sunset Drive-In. Okay, sure. Can we loot these now? Huh. Neat. Hmm. Sarsaparilla, cigarettes. That's it. Be nice if we found a lockpicking book in one of these. But I don't think that's going to happen. Still... Cigarettes are worth something. Worth picking up. Wow, someone had a little house back here? Oh, maybe that was where... Yeah, that was where the, uh, the projector would be, right? Okay. Hmm. Oh. Ah, there we go. Of course. Oh, shit! It's falling through the world! Eh. It's lost. It's gone forever. Wow, there's two of them back here. Alright, let's check out this one. Pre-war money? Sure. And let's mosey on up here. Oh, we're in combat, I think. Oh, no, there's just something nearby. Probably a ghoul. Yep, there it is. It's a roamer. Alright, let's fucking blast this fool. Oh shit! Is this my sheriff's outfit? What am I wearing? Oh god! Oh god! Why does this always happen? Ooh! Ooh! Wow, 50 XP. That guy was a threat. Get that mesquite, though. Oh shit, human flesh. I mean, that makes sense. I don't know why I'm freaking out. I'm still in the Morrowind state of mind a bit, I guess. Alright. Let's see. Let's put on our actual good, uh, sheriff's outfit. The duster. It doesn't come with any DR on it, but... Man, we looking... We look styling as hell. Eat some trash food. Let's see, what else? 
Let's drink some Nuka Colas. Eh. That'll all be good. Hmm. Anything out here? I know that's DLC land up there. Ugh. What's that? Some sort of little shack thing? I have no idea. Oh, what's this? Oh, a scenic overlook. Oh yeah, I guess so. I guess it is kind of scenic. <laughs> Up here? Yeah, we can see all of, um, all of Prim. Oh wow, there's <laughs> gunshots going off right as we, <laughs> right, right as we start admiring the, uh, the area. Oh shit! Oh, lad's life. Damn you, lad. Damn those lads. Oh, look at this, a little bear! A little cars! Going up and down. Oh, that's cute. But also kind of sad. Oh, true police stories. Still not what we need, though. Hmm. Let's push the bear down. Whee! Aww! That's good. Alright. What have we got? Any goodies up here? Oh, there's a lot of baddies. Coyotes. Flying coyotes. Let's quick save just in case we get overrun like crazy. Let's see, can we loot these? Crates. Frag grenades. More frag grenades. A whole bunch of them. Huh. A six. Oh, mysterious. It's backwards, though. One, uh, literate. Okay. Oh, man, it's a pup. Ah, oh, jeez. Uh-oh. Got locked onto Eddie for a moment. Tried clicking off. Didn't quite take. Alright. Sneak on up here and shoot these poor dogs. <laughs> Let's see. Invincible. Oh. Alright. Eh. Jesus, this is bad. We're doing a bad thing. <laughs> Good God. Alright. Anything, um... I guess we'll take the hide. Alright, now that's DLC land over there. There is a suitcase, though. No, let's not. We'll have we'll have a little treat for us when we come back here someday. Alright. Well, look, we're floating too, just like the coyotes. After we took their hides, we started to fly. Whew! Jesus, we're missing, like, left and right, aren't we? I wonder if I should just be shooting in the general direction and just count on the bullet uh, curving to occur. Let's try it. Yeah! <laughs> Alright, sure! I don't think that was actually a hit. There we go, we'll just shoot in its general direction. Oh. There we are. Let's see. Any locksmithy... Who's a what's it up here? Hello? Oh, there's a guy. Just an NCR trooper. All he had was a 9mm. Ooh, some fruit. Man, their armor is heavy as hell. Maybe we'll take it just in case. We can give it to Eddie to hold on to. I think we'll find some lighter armor, but for now, just in case we need it. There you go, Eddie. What is he doing in here with a whole bunch of ammunition boxes? Oh shit, he dropped it! Uh-oh. <laughs> Does that mean that a while ago he dropped, um, our Powder Ganger outfit? Damn it, Eddie! You bastard. 
All right. Eddie's just, like, laughing at us as we're making foolish mistakes, trying to give him armor to hold on to, and he's just, like, dumping it out of his butt hatch. Okay. Let's drink up some stew. Sugar bombs, why not? Okay. Make our way over there to that little diner. Let's store our weapon. Ooh, look. It's a pink one. Ooh, what's he doing? It looks like he's sitting on the can. But there is no can. Did we hit him? I don't know. Let's get closer and see what's up. Uh, hello? What are you doing? Uh. <laughs> what the fuck? Uh, I don't know about this. Oh, jeez. Oh, this isn't good at all. Where's our shovel? Or our, uh, our knife? There, there we go. Let's knife him. Ha ha! Take that, you... Ooh, it said something. Never! Ooh! Oh! Oh, look at him! Oh, he's all the way over there now! Oh, man! This is like the ring! Uh-oh. Uh... Uh, I don't know what to make of this. It's like... <laughs> Alright. Ah, uh, there they are. The sweet, uh, statue that we gotta make our way over to. Let's get back onto the road. Because we definitely want to take care of these banditos over here. All right, let's quick save too, just in case they hand our ass to ourselves, or to us. <laughs> we hand our own ass to ourselves. Oh, nice. Some cactus fruit. All right, where are you guys at? I know you're out here. Oh, there they are. Holy heck. Let's see, can we snipe the crap out of them? Maybe not. Maybe not at all. Let's get a bit closer. Jesus Christ, this is worse than XCOM. Oh, look, we got him. There we go. Hmm. More folks, but I don't see him. The sun is setting. Grab some of their garbage. Ah, stim pack's always good. Alright. Where are you, you filthy bastards? I know you're here. Turn on our light. Not picking anything up. Look, there's a big booty. Oh, jeez. <laughs> Implying uh, a little bit of anal. A little bit of anal. Film Lonely on the Nevada Highway Patrol station. Uh, how about some anal? <laughs> are you... Oh, yeah, here you are. Oh, look at you guys. Okay. Um, I'm just going to shoot you. Come on. Oh, where is he? He's, uh, he's hiding in the mesquite. Look at him. <laughs> Dingus. Alright. Well, let's just take their shit. <laughs> Good job, Eddie. Distracting them. That's my boy. Alright. Let's see. 10 millimeter. Absinthe. Why not? Leather armor. No, leather armor actually isn't that valuable, is it? Okay. Sneak on into here. Well, that was... Easier than it's usually been. Sometimes those those folks are uh, awfully tough. Okay. 
Oh, fuck you. Okay. <laughs> Forgot about those fucking graffiti and stuff. Did Fallout 4 have much in the... Oh, gosh. Okay, hello. Uh, let's see. Oh. Man, 70% chance, but we nailed her. Got him! Oh, look. Some little dudes. Let's pull out our, uh, our sweet knife. Any more? What are you shooting at, Eddie? You see him? I think they're behind the wall. Uh, right away, sure. Oh, a coffee pot! That's what we need! Here, let's grab another one of these mugs in case we see another coffee pot. That's what we need to make coffee, I think. Ugh. God, they sound like they're right next to me, but they aren't. Oh, guns and bullets. We should probably actually read all of our things that we've looted, now that we have, uh, comprehension. Let's see, are they in the- inside this one? Hello? No. Okay. Ooh, you can really hear them. It's a little unsettling, isn't it? Oh god, they sound really close. Okay, they must be in here. Ooh, look at them all! They're eating him! I think you can actually walk- just walk over these tiny ones and squish them. There we go. Oh, look at this guy! He's wearing a little hat! A dead prospector. Can we chop his hat head off? Oh yeah, we can. Ooh. All right. Nail board. A slave scarf. Huh. That's a new item. It must be from one of the DLC, huh? Okay. Sure. Let's um repair up a bit here. There we are. Okay, and let's also, um, let's see. We've got books to read, don't we? Let's start from the top. Uh, let's see here. There we go. Increase by four. Very good. Yeah, comprehension is just one of the best, uh, one of the better skills. Oh, guns and bullets. Increase by four. And let's see. Oh, line congressional style. I thought that was a, uh, a magazine for some reason. Um, let's see. Anything else? Not see. Oh, there we go. Alright, cool beans. Sweet. Nah, his outfit looks nice, but it's not really, uh, not something we want. Ammunition box. Oh, what the fuck? Where's the other one at? Is it behind here? Oh, yeah, look. It's caught. Gotcha. Huh. Okay, let's see. Grab some Hydra. Anything in here? Lead pipe and a nozzle. Uh, we could uh, break down stuff, but uh, we're not hurting for ammo that bad. We may, we may want to save that for when we're working um, on higher ammo classes, or ammo tiers. Okay. Anything in these? We already searched through these, right? Yeah. Okay. Cool beans. Let's head over to the outpost. That ought to do it. Here, let's wait until it's daylight out. Um... Let's see... 11 hours ought to be fine. Probably could have done with 10. But 11 is fine. We can actually cancel. Yeah, forget. It's slower, but we can actually just, uh... There we go. Cool. Now there's some assholes out here, apparently. We're picking them up on our radar. I don't see any, though. Besides the ones that we've already killed. Should be like a shitload of ants out in there. Good God. Oh. Oh, man. Can we finally get our revenge? Oh my god, we blew its head off! 
Oh my god! They explode into a pile of gore! Oh look! There's some of the assholes, okay. Ugh. Can we loot them? No. Alright. I'm fine with this though. Let's see. Oh, you shot me! <laughs> anything else out here? No, I don't see anything. I can't remember. Do we need eggs for anything? We could eat them. We could eat some ant eggs. Ugh, God, that that is disgusting. I would probably eat an ant sooner than I would eat an ant egg. Ugh, it's like... I would rather eat some some flies. I'd rather eat a fly that's been cooked than like maggots that have been cooked. It's that sort of situation. <laughs> I don't know what kind of situation that is. You know, one of those situations where you have to choose between eating flies or maggots. <laughs> Just one of those everyday situations that you come across in life. <laughs> I mean, even people, folks who who, oh God, what 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 what? Oh yeah. Scorpion, Scorpion Land. Oh God. But folks who who eat bugs a lot in their culture, wherever they live, I don't know. They don't even often opt for flies and maggots, right? It's usually um, crickets, isn't it? Because they're crunchy. Some kind of worm. I don't know. Maybe maggots are actually pretty popular. I know worms are a big deal. I don't know. Maybe I'm getting it confused with uh, that Snowpiercer movie, which is based off of like a book or something. All right, Scorpions no more. <laughs> you know that music is like a dude laughing at me. <laughs> I'm the Scorpion King. Any more, you bastards? Yeah, at least one more, maybe two. Ooh. Good job, Eddie. Man, Eddie is so helpful. Oh, there's one more. Look at them, they're guarding these prickly pears. They know that I'm a pear collector. These are the scorpion pear... pear gods. <laughs> That's what they are! Look, it's still alive. What's it doing? It's trying to eat the car. Oh, man. They eat cars. Ugh, god, scorpions are fucked up, man. Oh, can you interrupt the reload by tapping R again? Let's test that out. We're wasting ammo here, but... Let's try it. No. <laughs> Just wasted three rounds. It was worth it, though. Where's New Canaan anyway? I don't know. Where is it, man? You tell me. I don't remember that. Maybe that's part of, um... The texture pack. Let's see, is there anything back behind here? I remember one of these sorts of buildings had something behind it. Like a little secret stash. Eh, no secret stash here. Pack of cigarettes, though. Some cola. Sarsaparilla. Can't poke inside of there. Alright, maybe there's, um... Maybe there's a locksmith's digest or whatever the hell we're looking for in here. See, we're scouting out the area first. Scouting for bogeys. Gotta make sure the bogeys are not abound. Listen to that guy laughing at me! What a guy! <laughs> Alright. Let's head on in here. If I remember, this is completely abandoned. Yeah. Alright, we're good. A lot of looting going on, which I am A-OK -okay with. I enjoy good shooting loot. Let's see, what have we got? Flour. Probably use that for cooking. Oh, Mayor St Stains? Is that how you pronounce that? I don't know. Guess whose luck keeps rolling? A couple of star caps, dirty water, pugilism. Punching people. Alright. Anything in the register? Caps. Always good. Vodka. Oh, BBs. And a BB gun. 
May as well take those, I guess. Stim pack. Another stim pack. Oh, we should take the steak. What are we doing not taking the steak? That's actually worth taking. Huh. Oh, are her tits out? No, she's got, like, starfish on top of them. <laughs> Jeez. The, uh, added some pinups to this. Okay. Sure. What have we got in here? Wow. Whole bunch of silenced shit. Let's repair ours up. Can't be carrying around a whole bunch of silenced pistols. Alright. Eddie, you can take this BB gun. I know how much you fucking wanted a Red Rider or whatever it was called. What was it called? In that fucking Christmas show that everybody loves? God. It's not that great. Why do people like that, that show so much? It's it's really not that great. Maybe it's just be it's a nostalgia thing, and I just don't have that nostalgia. Same for, like, Grease? Oh my god, I fucking hate Grease. Ugh. Jesus. So, like, two of my least favorite movies. I'd like, uh, it's not a Christmas Carol, it's a Christmas story? I don't know. The one where the kid is like, you'll shoot your fucking eye out! I mean, it's okay, I guess, the first time you see it. It's certainly better than Grease. But, uh, good lord. They play it, like... Like, there's, there's just a channel that plays it all the time during the holiday season. Like, not even on Christmas Day, but, like, all before... All before Christmas as well. Good lord. It's just non-stop shooting your eye out. It's, uh... It's fucking god-awful, actually. I fucking hate it. <laughs> I don't hate many things in this world, but, uh... Grease and overplaying that... That movie... Oh, it gets my blood boiling, I tell you. Damn. It's supposed to be some shitload of ants out here. Oh, no, they don't come until we accept a quest. Okay. Oh! Oh, look, it's a guy! Hey, man! What are you doing? Oh, it's a traveling merchant. Have you got a good read for me? Hey there. Need anything? Yeah, I need a book. Sure, here's... Sure, here's what I got. A plasma defender, a GRA. Gunrunners something or the other. A rattan cowboy hat. Ooh, maybe we want that. Well, we have to buy it. We have to find out if we like it. All right, stim packs. Maybe we should take. No, f that. We're fine. Hmm. Small energy cells. Was that a mini nuki hat on him? Yeah. Look at that. Low yield. Tiny tots. Missile hive. Oh, look at all these things. Pretty expensive though. Maybe later we'll we'll come back and grab some. I mean, we'll never fucking find this guy again, but <laughs> from someone else we may well, buy some cards. I didn't even notice he had any of them. We need to be on the lookout for them. Alright, let's see. Can we sell you some stuff? Yeah, let's, uh, let's see here. We'll sell two of these, and sell all of these. Oh shit, we sold them way too much. That shit is really valuable, apparently. Queen of Spades. Almost didn't see that one there. Alright. Let's buy back some garbage. Jeez. Should have actually done some math on that. Oh my god. Oh yeah, they're worth a hundred? Wow. There you go. That's what I get for not paying any fucking attention to the, uh, the values. Good lord. Alright, let's... Try, try and get in here. Huh. Oh, God. There we go. Anything good in here? Look. Ooh, yeah, everybody loves these. A good nut. <laughs> what the hell? They're like uh, crappy pistachios. Maybe that's what they're called before they're, they're pistachios. They're called pinions. I don't know. Oh, who are you? Hello. Hey there. Oh, you're a mercenary. Okay. That's fine. You should know that there's, uh, some bad dude over there. I don't know, some sort of, like, wild rad scorpion. Pissed as all hell. Alright. Let's get on up here. I love this. Good, uh, environmental design. How you can see what you're working your way up toward. Slowly looting all this stuff. I'm into it. It's, um... Elevation is very important in uh, open world design. A lot of uh, a lot of Bethesda's 
I mean, I know this isn't made by Bethesda, but a lot of uh, Bethesda's modern stuff uses a lot of verticality in their towns. Like Diamond City in Fallout 4 is a perfect example. It's um, it's all elevated around the outer ring, so that way when you're entering, you can easily see everything on the inside. And when you're on the interior, it makes it seem bigger because you can look out and see that you're surrounded by the city and all that. Same with um, in Skyrim, the the starting town. What's it called? Not River Run, but the first one with uh, Yal Bar Balgroof or whatever his freaking name is. It's kind of got a uh, elevated sort of situation going on. They even did it in Morrowind with um, Aldrune had a bit of that action going on. Not nearly as uh, much because obviously uh, a lot of it was fogged up, so you couldn't see around. Oh look, the texture pack makes it look pretty nice. I think. Look at that! Looks like it's actually made out of scrap. Man, good on you, texture pack guy. That texture pack was made by a single person. Pretty impressive. In the year 2271, the Desert Rangers of Nevada and the Rangers of the New California Republic met at this spot to sign the Ranger Unification Treaty. Under this treaty, the Desert Rangers agreed to be absorbed into the NCR in exchange for NCR's protection of, the Ho of Hoover Dam, New Vegas, and Southern Nevada against the forces of Caesar's Legion. Cool. Now, um, the, uh, the Desert Rangers are here on the right. They're, uh, it's, it's meant to be, like, um, based on Wasteland, which was, like, a progenitor, I believe, for, uh, Fallout. Made by the same folks who did, um, Brian Fargo, I think, and all of them, right? Uh, who made, um, the first two Fallout games, which are, like, um, isometric sort of CRPGs. Oh, Sergeant Kilborn? Wow, what a name. Coming from the north? Must be crazy to brave those roads. Uh, what is this place? Outpost. Mojave Outpost. Watching a lot of nothing feels like a big Brahmin pen for caravans. They've been stopped for a while, waiting for the roads north to clear. Or the clearance papers to go through. Looks like you've walked away, so if you need to shake the dust off, head to the barracks at the bars there. Not much, but better than nothing. Hmm. Any work around here? Nothing I know of. But if you've come from the north, means you can travel freer than most around here. Might check the barracks. Someone might need you to hoof it somewhere. Just be careful you go up on the roof. Got a sniper watching the road. If your gear's in need of repair, HQ's also worth checking out. Talk to Major Knight. He can help. Provided you got a pen and plenty of ink. Uh, what are those statues of? Those two? Represents unification. Mostly good for shade. Won't do much else when the Legion reaches us. Uh, I'll be going now. Watch yourself. But yeah, in Wasteland uh, 1 and 2, the Desert Rangers are like the dudes you're working for. I never actually finished finished Wasteland 2. I never even touched Wasteland 1 because it's so enormously old. I don't know if I even ever plan to go back and finish it. But yeah, I should play uh, Wasteland 2 one of these days. Maybe I'll stream it or something. I don't know. I've been working on getting stream set up. A little behind the scenes there for you. It'll be fun. Oh, got the Brahmin pens here. Oh, they sleep on these. Huh. Look at you, you friggin' Brahmin. You guys got it made. What's that? Oh, man, the Brahmin are also getting fucking wasted. Hell yeah, Brahmin. Oh, man. Oh, look at this dude. What is this dude doing here? I don't think I've ever remembered this guy. Oh, it's just a generic guy. Howdy. <laughs> Howdy. Okay. Let's see, who are we looking for here? We're looking for the the main hotshot, aren't we? There's a lot of quests we can get here, but we'll uh, we'll do that next time for now. We need to make sure that we uh, get this sheriff finally. Um, let's see, must be this guy, Major Knight. Caravan, citizen, pilgrim, or... Uh, I'm a courier. Just need something for the logbook, keeping tabs on traffic throughout the outpost. Although mostly just in, not out these days. If you're looking for the commanding officer, he's in the back. Although, he's got a lot on his plate, so if you speak with him, keep it short. Also, if you need any gear checked, we can get you up and running again. Once you fill out the work orders and sign for the parts, of course. Mmm, I'd like to talk to you about Prim. Prim? A's units are stationed up there. We're having problems with some of the NCRCF convicts. What can I help you with? 
one of the convicts from NCRCF is looking for a pardon so he can protect Prim. One of the powder gangers? They've been nothing but trouble for us. Why would we want one of them anywhere in an official capacity? Um, hmm. Oh, we have to bribe them. Okay. Ooh, no, wait. We can actually... Mm, yeah. Hang on. Hang on, hang on. Hold that thought. Keep that thought. Never mind. I'll be leaving. Let's see. Let's see. Mm, let's see. I just, like, immediately whip out this fucking book and start reading it right in front of him. Let's see. Where's our speech book? Uh, barter... Jesus, what was it called? I can't remember any of the names for the magazines. Or really anything. Oh, meeting people. Okay. Here we go. Back again, I... Uh, let's see. Talk about Prim. Yep. Yada, yada, yada. One of... There we go. His sentence was almost up. And he isn't tied to the Powder Gangers. Uh, all right. If his sentence was closing up, I can see about getting him pardoned. Prim is important to our trade up from California. So having someone there who owes us a favor... That couldn't hurt. Alright, cool. Anything I can do to help around here? Help? Oh, well, you could speak to Ranger Jackson. He might have something for you. He sort of runs things around here. Mostly ends up sending reports back west that aren't filled with the best news. Alright, who are you? Me? I'm Knight. Major Knight. I've been stuck here dealing with these caravans for ages now, but somebody's got to do it. Uh, what, can you tell me about the outpost? NCR border guard duty, mostly. It's our job to make sure the caravans can move safely along I-15 and Highway 95. Not the best posting or assignment, but it beats being sent east, or patrolling the Colorado. Legion's pretty thick there. Alright. Eh, we don't need repairs. At least not yet. Sir. Wow, calling me sir? Hey. Okay. <laughs> we said that earlier as well. Alright, let's head on back to Prim and finally get this dude initiated. Let's see. Jeez, it's been a long time coming for old Prim. Finally, they got a they got a sheriff. Let's see. Where are they at? Must be out. Yeah, there he is. All the way over yonder. And then, that way, once some time has passed, we can come back, finally get gambling, make some money here. Easy peasy. What's up, Hello. Myers? Thanks for getting me that pardon. Me and the boys will take good care of Prim. Don't you worry. Alright, cool. I put my trust in you. If you don't fucking do a good job, I'm gonna blast your ass apart. Watch yourself out there. Oh, look. We got a sweet level up as well. Let's see. Let's get our melee up to 45. Good. Okay. And science, let's... Let's try and get as close to 50 as possible. That's our next order of business. Cool beans. All right. Nice. Well, I suppose everything is all sorted out. We should, uh, let's go talk to the deputy in Nash. They may have something else to say before we head out of here. We'll head back to, uh, next time we'll, we'll head over to the Mojave outpost and get some, uh, get some work done there for them. Because, man, they need the help. Let's see, here we are. wonder if they're still in here. We never did find any more, uh... Locksmithing stuff. Which is unfortunate. To say the Brim least. Wimped out and accepted NCR rule. Some people will do anything to feel safe. What are you talking about? No, we didn't! No, no, you guys didn't! You got, you got what's his name? Heard it was you brought the law back to Prim, youngster. Hats off to you. Um... How's Prim these days? Got a new sheriff, as you know. Meyer's a bit rougher hewn than I might have liked, but he seems like a good sort. So far, so good. Well, that's good to hear, Nash, because if he isn't, you fucking tell me. I'll blow his ass apart. <laughs> uh, do you have anything for sale? Well, give me a moment to get back to my shop, and I'll show you my stock. Cool. Bye. And what about Ruby? Does she have anything to say? Howdy. Where'd she go? Oh, let's ask the deputy. Well... If it isn't the lawbringer. What's your problem now? My problem is that I'm no longer a deputy. I'm just a beagle now. <laughs> Apparently two and a half months of law enforcement experience doesn't count for anything. The new regime is just that. All new. He's a good sheriff, but a hard man. He doesn't abide by anyone slinking by the rules. I guess there won't be any trouble, but the man's law is hard. Hmm. Howdy. 
I wonder who the new deputy is then. Mm -hmm. All right. Too bad we couldn't just make all three of them sheriff and just like have them duel to the death for the honor of being sheriff of the great, fantastic town of Prim. My God, what an honor it would be. <laughs> oh. What an honor it would be. <laughs> Ruby Nash. Welcome back. Good to see you again. Tell me about Prim. Thanks to you, Prim's on the way back up. With folks watching over us, I think the raiders will keep their distance. All right. Later. <laughs> yeah, later, Grandma. Damn, Grandma's hip as hell. Let's wait for an hour and hopefully uh, they'll all be back in their... Uh... Yeah, there we go. Johnson Nash. Nope, not stuck out there anymore. Okay. Good guy. Let's see. Oh, all God. Right. I, thought his, I thought his forehead was chopped up or something. Hey there, youngster. Um, let's see. Does he have anything else to say now? Let's buy Things stuff. Things pretty good with Myers watching over us. I can give you a little bit of a discount. Oh, cool beans. Let's see. Do you have anything worth it at all, though? Boxing times? No, not really what we need. Hmm. Fixing things. That old incinerator we sold him. Oh, a service rifle. Huh. Not really what we're looking for, though. All right, let's sell him some more of these frag grenades. Oh, jeez, he can only take one, can't he? can take a mine, though. All right. That'll have to do. Okay. Thanks. Well, when next we come back... See ya. We'll fast travel on back to the, uh... The Mojave outpost. Get some quests going on there. I think there's some ants. We'll meet, uh... A companion. We'll, um... We might even go on to, uh, find some terrible, awful things happening in the, uh, Mojave Wasteland. Goodness me. And hopefully along the freaking way, we'll be able to find a, uh, another locksmith book. That way we can finally get this unique revolver. God, I wish I remembered where it was. <laughs> I'm hoping it's the one inside, uh, the Bison Steve that we had to leave behind. Hopefully. Fingers crossed. Because I remember the, uh, the revolver looked very nice. It had, like, a nice little bit of art to it. Alright. Till next time. Peace.